What's up, guys? I um, just want to do a review on a couple of the boards I have, um, give my insight on what my experience was riding them. Um, I'm first going to talk about my Lanyots 9 to 5 board. Um, as you can see here, giraffe, what up? I got the um, bear trucks, zombie hogs, white. Reds, bearings, you don't care about that. We all know what's to do. We all we all know what to do with that. Um, I did my first board or my third board, the one I was riding previous, Apex thirty seven from original. Um, love the board, still love the board, love the trucks. Um, I did another video talking about the trucks. Um, I think one of the problems with some of the reviews on the nine to five was no one really talked about how it rides. Uh, people are like, oh, the graphics really sweet. I love I love the board. It's so stiff. Yeah, no one cares. Okay, so um I've got my bear trucks which are sick. Um one in front of truck that was, you know, in between like a downhill truck, but you could still carve with it, you know, a little bit like I looked at it between an original and a Randall, and I came with the bears. Um, they're sweet. It's such a s solid ride. Stand-up sides are awesome, and this board totally helps out. Um, if you've done any other research on this board, you know all about the uh, dimensions and like the uh, this and that, and well, your feet sticking in like a dream, and the gas pedals and all that stuff. Um, I was a little bit not surprised, but I noticed how not carvy like I had a hard time carving with this board like I could with my apex even even with the bear trucks on my apex um but that's not why I bought the board so it wasn't huge let down um you know, I understood that you're probably gonna sacrifice some carvability for your downhill and sliding um this board you have so much control over the board and what it does at any speed um at first, I was a little nervous to like throw in some standies, like going kind of fast, because I've never really done that before. But once I just let it happen and just shoved right into it, it just like it just went, and you're like, "Oh, this is awesome!" Um, your feet are definitely locked in here. Um, no worries about that. Drifting around corners is so fun. Um, going downhill, I feel unbelievably locked in. Like I can just dominate the whole world. Um, of course, I really don't go that fast yet. Um, yeah, if you're looking for a board that you want to slide with, that you want to go downhill with, you want to do manuals with, this board is legit. I loved like all those three. Um, I was looking at a couple of the boards like the uh, Tin Tian from Loaded, because I went for my original Apex, and the Tin Tian's kind of similar. And I was debating whether that would be a good fit, because um, that's a lot of like freestyle. You can pretty much do whatever. But when I stepped on the tin tin and I stepped on this, just like standing on it, I knew that this is the board I want because my feet were so locked in. Uh, I sacrificed the ability to do like kick flips or whatever crazy trick fl flip tricks the guys can do on those um, for this, for the um, downhill side of this board and. Uh, in that side. I can still do manuals on this, which is just fun. I love doing manuals and um, nose manuals and normal manuals, whatever that's called. I don't even know, but it's fun. Um, so yeah, what are this can I tell you? The graphics so cool. There's a giraffe and I love giraffes. It's business time. Nine to five, get it? Eh. Um, yeah, if you have any questions, let me know.